Hi guys, uh, it's Idris here. Uh, it's been a long night for me, but uh, you guys will be seeing it as a, like free videos because this is my uh, third part of my unboxing, which is uh, Majesty Lord Blaster Special Deck Set. So, MLB has finally come to uh, the V era and Bushiro decided to give it a special deck. And you can see here the box is actually a lot smaller than the uh, legend deck. But doesn't matter, we are just going to box it and see what's in there. I put this as my last unboxing video because the MLB deck set actually doesn't involve anything in random but for fast collection and premium collection you never know what we get uh, even GR and SGR so that's why I put them first and this to last and I have to say the paper box is actually a little bit hard to open which I don't know why I don't want to hurt the box too much there we go and uh, this paper box is really a normal paper box because the real thing is this uh, leather box and you can uh, uh, you can't smell it but when I smell I can smell like those new a little bit plastic kind of smell yep a little, a little not too much and this is our box so it's new that Bushiro make this kind of boxes for Japanese I'm not too sure about the English side but uh, this is new and of course with some paper taking out spaces we have our uh, MLB sleeves so these looks alright and of course the main dish is the deck itself so I'm going to put the box here and let's take a look at the deck so first we can take a look at the SPR MLB which looks fine cool so quickly unbox this and let's see what's in there first I'm not going to look at this stuff and when I see force 2 and you don't see force 1 so I am hoping it will be a double sided force marker and yes it is so thank you Bushi for helping out to save the planet even though you're using paper for card games but at least you're trying to save. So first we have our MLB. So I have already explained the skill in a separate video before. So he can uh, get a crit 5k and drive if you have Buster Blade and Buster Tiny Soul. If it's a regard, he will just get a crit and when attack put two regards in so get two force markers and these are all uh, VR versions of course SVR is a lot greater but VR version is also great and if you do notice this foiling I think it's very close to uh, our very first set blaster blade foiling which is cool so for people who want to uh, full foil their MLB deck, they will need to buy 4 of these which all cost 8,000 yen and uh, well I'm lucky that I can bought it with uh, a pre-order price which is 520 Hong Kong dollars so I'm really really lucky because I was planning to buy these in Japan but then things happen and uh, the Fiji Fest is cancelled and for some reason the uh, pre-order in Hong Kong the period is very very short I think it's within a day so a lot of people couldn't catch it and I, I was one of them so 
uh, this shop is very kind to help me out to find this stuff so I can still get them cheap because if you are going to find it in Hong Kong right now I think most stores if you haven't pre-ordered it is not 520 is likely to be 700 so I'm lucky and then we have uh, only two gallatins so uh, they are just vanillas but if you are playing a uh, deck like old mile then gallatin can sometimes help you because they got 10k shield and old mile will give them 5k shield extra so if you are going to buy a uh, old mile starter and maybe some old mile PRs then maybe gallatin will be helpful to you and of course you can see the blaster plate foiling is the same with MLB so that's nice and we get uh, one of the uh, special TD illustration from the uh, writer of creator of Vanguard and we have three uh, other versions and then we have uh, four blaster ducks which uh, only this version contains the text that uh, this card is also belonging to Royal Pardons if I'm not wrong so if that's the case if you want to use Blaster Duck in uh, Royal Pardon you can only use this copy you can't use other copies and say uh, they are Royal Pardons because only this version contains the text and let's push your say it will do an erector on Blaster Duck and make sure everyone can enjoy a different version of Blaster Duck put into Royal Pardon deck we can only use this once and then of course we have 4 star call which is very key help you to get the order card and game boost when you have a blaster vanguard finger brave uh, in the past is a great zero attack hit go to soul and search you for a blaster but now it becomes a great one as long as attack hits or boost attack hits the vanguard you can look at top 7 and search for a blaster add to your hand and shuffle your deck and this card don't need to go to soul so this is some kind of madness here and this card I can't remember if it's a PR or not but it is a very good card that when it appears uh, pick one up uh, right pick up to one grade 2 from your drop at your deck top or deck bottom if you place them during your turn this one it will get 10k so you can recycle your grade 2s like blaster blade and you get uh, Tristan so have you search for a blaster blade we get a uh, black enchanter which uh, when your blaster blade appe appears you can soul charge one and soul charge and then if you don't have any phase of damage counter charge one okay which I might need some help to consider if this is a soul charge 2 or not but anyway and then we have a buckle as a starter then quickly get into triggers crits crits and PD draws heals and we get a quick shield and free order cards so this basically is a playable deck but uh if you really really want to make some changes of this deck then uh, it depends on your direction because some people want to play uh, the messianic lord blaster then you need to add a lot of blaster cards like blaster arrows blaster dagger all this stuff and aim for a high critical high power vanguard attack to finish your opponent in one go or if you are only playing MLB like MLB focus your grade 3 will likely be only for uh, MLB because you can just gain force marker by attacking so you don't need to rewrite anything you might take the guillotines out of course you need blaster blade, you need blaster ducks, you need uh, star call 
you need Ring of Brave. Uh, this you might want to keep as well. Tristan depends. And uh, this comes into our uh, first collection. Which let me do a quick check on my stuff. Bring this very, very close. It's here. So, something that you can use from uh, the face collection. Uh, spoiler alerts, this is uh, what I post because I do put uh, my videos like face collection unboxing first. So, if you watch this one first, and if you do want to watch your, uh, my face collection uh, unboxing, you can go to there first. But if doesn't matter then yeah so these are some of the stuff that you can actually use like uh, Marin a good great one because uh, you can draw with Marin and, sh and he will get power uh, Gordon then Gordon can be can be a booster for blaster so another good card that you can consider and since they are just uh, rares in fast collection their price will likely be lower and what you need to do is just adding a little bit grade 2 and grade 1 and most of the stuff will be exactly the same like you can take this and maybe these out for parents uh, take out the gallatins for Gordon then you can have a more optimized MLB or if you did buy the odd mouse starter then you can have those uh, great tools that help you filling your field which is, is up to you and they won't cost you a lot of money because it's just the most expensive part for MLB deck is actually the starter this starter deck so that costs you 8,000 yen but other stuff these are rares another one is starter which gives you four copies of everything then you're good to go yeah so this video is quick because again everything is fixed and uh, I think a lot of people already explained to you how you can upgrade your MLB deck but if you do want some advice comment down below and uh, I can give you a little bit more suggestions there yeah so thanks for watching and i will see you guys in the next video which hopefully will be a five video signing off